house and then we're gonna drive to Nashville from there but her house is three hours from here and then we have a like an hour drive from there so that's not bad but it is I almost said 5 35 right it's 9 35 a.m. but in Alabama it is 8 35 so pretty early start obviously I'm running 35 minutes late in a quarter of a mile so I just switched the time zone over on my car that means tonight is the 1975 concert yeah! I'm so lit no, I hated that. I'm so excited. Yeah, the outfit is a little more edgy than I'm used to. I'm wearing like a chain on my belt and bands. Like, I just went for it today. So, I'm literally star Turn right onto starving. Almost out of gas. So, that's awesome. Gotta get gas and then Starbucks. And then I'll probably... And then I'll... In half a mile. Turn and then I'll be on the road. So, that's the update. I don't want to wait, though, because like when I get to my friend's house, we're going to go get lunch. So, I was like, I could wait. There's like a Starbucks like an hour from here. That's like along the way that's kind of like a pit stop but like i feel like i should eat now but eat something small it's like a bagel bite or like something small just to hold me over in 1000 feet i don't know when i'll talk to you guys next i'll probably be like a little halfway there update but turn yeah. right on if this thing interrupts me one more time i'm gonna scream but yeah guys the 1975 concert going to nashville so excited so i guess i'll see you guys in a little bit got my starbucks set the road so of a mile i have about an hour left but i'm leaving my grandparents house so basically like i just stuck it in my gps and hit the road and like it took me off the interstate and i was like wait this is like a mile from my grandparents house let me just drop by and say hey so i just stopped by not long like 10 15 minutes just to chat for a second i'm hitting the road again have about an hour left the drive has been so easy there's been no one on the road knock on wood being thankful not jinx and things so but yeah guys i guess i'll just turn see, left onto i guess i'll just see you when i make it to my friend's house or not i don't know when but i'll let you guys know like right before i get there so i'll see you in like an hour <laughs> oh my gosh hi guys so it is now 12 o'clock i'm like 10 minutes away so i just wanted to update you guys we're just gonna get lunch and then head on to nashville for the concert i made a playlist of like all the songs on their set list just so i like knew every single song i do that for every concert i go to just because i don't I don't know. I don't want to know exactly everything that they're playing in like the order, but like I just kind of want to know all the songs, you know? It's just more fun that way when you know every word to every song that they sing. So I always make a playlist just of like all the songs that are on their set list. So I've listened to it three times through, so I think I'm getting pretty good, pretty familiar with all the songs. So yeah, it's been raining, and I don't know if I mentioned this is an outdoor concert. So I was talking to somebody yesterday, like it would be so awesome if it rained. Like I went to a train concert and it was outside and it rained the whole time and it was so much fun like just being in the rain and like dancing listening to music singing it's really fun the issue is thunder and lightning they'll cancel that out real quick so hopefully it won't like thunder and lightning and like get canceled because that would be unfortunate but yeah a little rain never hurt nobody oh this is a bridge i'm not terrified awesome love this oh great we're going up higher awesome this bridge is literally ginormous oh my gosh we're so high uh, I guess I don't know when I'll actually talk to you guys next maybe tomorrow kind of recap the concert But yeah, see you guys in Nashville
This is the 1975. last night amazing it's 9 20 so love that the concert incredible it's so good me and my friend are gonna try to go to the atlanta show on saturday it's thursday so right now the tickets there's only two left in the pit and it's 500 dollars and i don't freaking think so so we're just gonna pray about that one the girl behind us though like literally we think she overdosed on drugs Anyway, moving on from that, so much fun. So we're gonna try to do Pit, just because we tried to get Pit for this show, but it sold out in like two seconds, so we had to just get seats. So I'll keep you updated on that. Hey guys, so it is like one, it's Saturday. I'm about to run some errands because I think I'm gonna go to the 1975 concert tonight. Sorry, I just ran up the stairs. So, just got kind of ready. I'm gonna run to Starbucks, the bank, do a couple things, come back, get ready, go. So, I'll see you guys in a little bit, and I'll update you, so. A few moments later. Guys, oh my gosh, okay. So, I don't know if I explained in that last clip where I was like, I'm going to the 975 concert. I didn't have tickets yet, and it's the concert's in like six hours, so that's awesome, but yeah. After the Nashville concert, me and my friend were like, we have to go again, blah, blah, blah. She has a wedding, so she couldn't get out of it. So I was just kind of checking, hoping, and this morning I woke up and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna go. Even though I'm going by myself, I went to Harry Styles by myself and made friends. So let me just go to this one, like, by myself. So I woke up, recorded that clip, still didn't have tickets. Like, tickets this week have been, like, 500, 600, there are some for 1,000. I was like, bye. But I- And I- oh. At the end of the day, I was like, you know what? If tickets drop, I'm just gonna get one. You know what I'm saying? I've just been checking all day and I woke up and there was some for like 160, which is way better than, um, you know, 500. So I was like, you know, 160 is not bad. And I have this like, this bucket of change. It's empty now, but it was filled to the top with change that I just like wanna get home, I throw it in the bucket. So I was like, let me just go deposit this. Like I threw it in one of those coin counting machines and got cash back. I had like $80 of change in there. So I was like, you know what? Like I've been saving this change. I've been meaning to do this. Let me just get the 160 ticket. I like go to get it. One has popped up for a hundred. I typed in my credit card information so fast, literally so fast. So I got it. It's now two, the concert's at seven. Oh my gosh, I have five hours. So I have to go home. Thankfully I showered. There's literally geese crossing the road. Hello, I'm literally stopped for these freaking geese to cross the road. Awesome, amazing. So I'm headed home, even though there's a slight detour apparently, waiting for the freaking geese. I got Starbucks, got my mom something, so nice. It was her money, so guess I'm not that nice. So I'm gonna go home, throw on some clothes, head that way because the pit's not that big, but I still wanna get a good seat. Seat, right. Still wanna get a good spot. I'm gonna have to get dinner on the way because, you know, I don't wanna literally pass out from standing and screaming. So I'm probably just gonna get Chick-fil-A and eat it in the car. On the way there, I need to bring my portable charger. At the Harry Styles concert, I had like mints and snacks and water and I was like passing them out to people. I was like the total dad of the group. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna go home, speedily change, and then head that way, I guess, to Atlanta. Get a good spot in line. So I'll see you guys later. Oh my God. <laughs> So, it is exactly three o'clock, which I'm leaving exactly when I wanted to, so who's shocked? I am. Yeah, just wanted to update you. I changed, got ready for the concert. I think I'm gonna go to 
Chick-fil-A and get some food because I've only had a smoothie bowl today and I'm gonna be standing and jumping around. So don't wanna pass out, which is what a lot of people do in pits at concerts, especially outdoor and it's hot. So don't wanna be that guy that passes out. But today's been crazy. I woke up and I wasn't going and then all within the past hour, I've decided to go change, hit the road. So it's been pretty crazy. I'm going alone again, which is fine. In Nashville, the pit was not very full, especially when we got there. We got there like an hour early. We were in seats, but we could see the pit. And like, I think I'm gonna be able to get pretty close being there an hour before doors so i don't know i'll keep you updated but yeah guys i'm headed to atlanta so i'm gonna get chick-fil-a and then hit the road so see you later i'm pissed okay so basically this portion of the vlog i proceeded to rant for like five minutes about the situation that happened so i just kind of wanted to condense it because it sounded super first world problems complainy ranty whatever didn't want to put you through that so you're welcome so basically what happened i got there about two hours early to get in line and there were about 20 people in front of me and we were all excited you know thought it was going to be a ga pit because our tickets had pit and basically some guy comes out there after a little while and is like by the way this isn't a ga pit you all have a seat number on your ticket that is a seat and it's not a GA pit. So the people that have been sitting there all day started raging on him and it wasn't clear because it wasn't called floor seating, it was called a pit. So everyone assumed it was a GA pit, but it wasn't. So I ended up having like a seat. So there was no point for us to be there. So he was like, go away basically. And so we went to Starbucks. I went to Starbucks and just chilled there for literally two hours waiting for the concert to start because there was no point in sitting in line because it wasn't gonna be a GA pit and whoever was there you know, got barricade. So I ended up sitting on the 20th row. That's where my seat was. And so I was just angry about it and angry about the way that the venue handled the situation. But yeah, I just wanted to condense this from like a five minute rant down a little. So you're welcome basically. And so let's just get back into the happiness of the video because I was gonna leave this video in, but I honestly don't care anymore. The concert was really fun, but in that moment I was fuming. So love you. You hated that. Bye. I'm gonna have fun. I just need to like sit and just, you know, chill for a little bit in the Starbucks and then I'll be back and update you when I'm in a little better mood because right now I'm angry at this er, venue. So, love you. <laughs> Hey guys, so it is currently six o'clock and I've just been chilling in Starbucks, charging my phone, watching YouTube, the huge. So probably gonna head over now. The concert starts at seven, you know, gotta park, walk in, go to my seat. No, but really it's fine. I just needed to like, amazing rage for a little second. And then now I'm fine. I'm just excited to see 1975 again because at the end of the day it's about the music so let's go 1975 round two baby so Right 
up you guys so i am leaving the concert i was gonna wait until i got like out of atlanta before i talked to you but i assume i'm gonna be sitting here for a while in traffic waiting but yeah the concert was amazing they're always so much fun the energy was like better tonight than wednesday like the people around me wednesday me and my friend were like <laughs> and everyone else around us was like <laughs> but tonight everyone around me was like <laughs> so it was a lot of fun kind of losing my voice like goodbye amazing it was literally three million degrees and it was like an outdoor amphitheater so it kind of was like the land was like this and then the venue was like down here in like a bowl so awesome go go good lordy mercy my gosh awesome amazing so good love four-way stops those are the best people follow the rules there Oh my gosh, praise the Lord, we're out of the traffic. But yeah, guys, it was so hot and it was like down, so there was no wind. Wednesday, the venue was on a river and like it wasn't like, it was like in the middle of downtown, I almost said New Orleans, right? Nashville, so there was like a breeze the whole time. Tonight, there was no breeze. It was hot as frick. Still so much fun, I'm a sweaty mess. I'm sorry that you had to hear me rant about stuff. I'm super grateful that I got to go and it was so much fun. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, subscribe. Check out my other videos, my other concert vlogs if you liked this. So trying to conserve this last, this melted ice that I had left from freaking a million years ago. Do I go straight? I hate this. I've never hated something more in my whole life. I hate this. I literally hate this. Amazing. What the freak was that? Sorry. So check out my other videos. Like this one, dislike it. Do what you gotta do. Comment down below anything you want. Say hey. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, Disco. Say hey there. I'll say hey back. But yeah, guys, thank you for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.